Plain shortbread, a combination of the most basic ingredients in a baker's pantry, is an understated sweet, but millennial shortbread is a spectacle. It basically has a buttery shortbread topped with chewy caramel and shiny chocolate ganache. And when you bite into it, it's like enjoying a cookie and a candy bar at the same time. Hey guys, I'm Chef Aruna from Truffal Nation Baking Academy where we help aspiring bakers just like you to become professional bakers and start your own successful business. So without wasting more time, let's make the shortbread. First, in a bowl, we'll cream butter and sugar till light and fluffy. Here, I am using unsalted butter and caster sugar. In this, we'll add milk and vanilla and give it a quick mix. Now we will save flour and salt to it and mix again to get the perfect dough. So our dough is ready. We'll keep this aside and prepare the tin by clean wrapping it twice and placing a butter paper at the bottom. We'll shape this into a baking tray. Now. We'll place the dough into the tin and spread it using a spatula. As our dough is a little bit stiff, we will have to apply a little bit pressure while spreading the dough to get an even top. Now, with the help of a fork, we'll dock it so that we get an evenly baked crust. Our tin is ready for the oven. We'll bake it at 180 degrees Celsius for about 25 to 30 minutes. So meanwhile our shortbread is baking, let's make the chewy caramel. For this, we'll place condensed milk. Unsalted butter. Corn syrup.
vanilla essence and salt. Now to check the consistency, we'll take cold water and one drop of caramel in it. If we can shape this caramel with our fingers, then it means it's ready to use. As you can see, we can shape this caramel with our fingers, which means it's ready for use. Our shortbread is also about to come out from the oven. We'll pour our caramel over it and let it set in the fridge for 15 to 20 minutes. We'll now keep this in the fridge for about 15 to 20 minutes. Now let's make our chocolate ganache. For this, I am using semi-sweet dark coverture chocolate. You can use compound chocolate as well, but it won't give the rich taste of chocolate that we want. We'll melt our chocolate. You can melt it in a double boiler, but I am gonna melt it in a microwave in 30 second burst of time. We have already warmed our cream. Now we'll mix both the cream and chocolate together to get the shiny and smooth ganache. Our ganache is ready and our shortbread is also out of the fridge. Now we'll pour the ganache over it. We'll give a wavy look over the ganache using a small spatula. Now we'll just sprinkle some flaky sea salt on top. Now we'll let it set for a few minutes in the fridge. Our millennial shortbread is out of the fridge. Now we'll demold it. For demolding, we'll first remove the cling wrap and then we'll loosen the sides using heat gun. Now we cut it. Before cutting it, we'll warm the knife. Here you go. Our millennial shortbread is ready. I hope you guys like this recipe and do like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon every time we post a new recipe.